State Command walked up and said, she said, I'm from York, Pennsylvania. <laughs> she told my back lip and preached. She said, I haven't been doing, I have been preaching, I haven't been doing nothing. She said, I've been dying on the vine right here. We got to turn the boat back to preach today. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> hey, man, got the old boy back for going on with God again. Now he lives over near us. He don't come to see us as much as he used to, but he can In fact, he lives far away from us. Now he lives only 40 miles away. He don't come to see us. Isn't that something? I, I'm, I'm coming to see you once. This is a little 40 miles away. I'm coming to see you once. I call him on 40 and say, what's the matter? I'm working. Well, I'm busy. God's looking for a better job. I don't think he likes to talk to me because I think you ought to quit his job and go to preaching. But I think you ought to do <laughs> <laughs> I think he's got himself in a position. But God's going to finish what he's doing. Praise the Lord. Amen. There's no place to run. I was telling brother here last night, I said, you don't have to run. He, he said, she's so much cheaper. And I said, anyway, they call it engagement. Oh, okay. That's where I go. It's the same story. Remember this, though. If I can see what I can tell you about it. This is not found. The Christians in this town need to take the responsibility for this town. And quit ignoring what God tries to do something. Maybe you can't do the job right now the way you want to. So God sends somebody to help do that job. That's the one to get behind. We can break that yoke. I'm going to go on the way. I ain't going to save Jesus. I promise. I ain't, ain't going to save Jesus. Don't worry about me. I ain't going to start no church here. I ain't going to become no bishop here. No general prophet here. No, so I'm going to get out of here as soon as God says so. I promise you, I promise you, won't leave, don't want your town, don't want your people, don't want your money. Hallelujah. <laughs> Amen. So just like to have your fellowship, like to have your love, come on, like to have your serving the Lord. No, 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 come back a year later and see some of the work going on. That'd be worth everything. I used to pray to old Paul sitting there in the old jail. Somebody come running in and Paul say, how's the church doing with everything? How's the church doing with Paul Glacier's having some trouble. Somebody come in and take him away. 